Hey guys, Anthony for Before Diesel with a really important warning for if you're going to do these uh, front hub bearings yourself, um, you've got to make sure you do it right. Now what's happened here is, um, this is the Hilux front wheel bearing assembly. Um, we supply them with a genuine hub and the bearing and the genuine seal with our little upgrade, um, all pressed together ready to go. But you just need to gently remove the, if you've got no ABS, you're going to have this spacer and this spacer or retainer, whatever you want to call it. If you've got ABS, you're going to have a different ABS ring instead of this, and then that goes on top. Ever so gently, it'll only take you a minute to put a screwdriver under and gently work your way around slowly. Don't bend it, don't damage it, but work it off, and then you'll be able to sit it in place over the top here. And just with a hammer, as we've demonstrated in other videos, give it a gentle tap and bring it down, and it'll, it'll be a little bit tight as it goes on. It'll be loose when it gets all the way, and it'll be loose again, and it'll spin. Anyway, this guy, he's forgotten to do that. So he's probably under the pump a bit in a bit of a rush. He's probably got to get, got to get this job done. Probably had a few other complications. You know, didn't clean out the spines down in there and had a bit of issues with it. You know, it's a Hilux thing. The drive shafts can be a bit hard to slide in, stuff like that. So you need to sort of clean those spines up a bit, lube them up a bit, check them in case there's any little burrs could cause a bit of resistance. I'm just making assumptions here. Could be completely wrong, but what's happened is he's forgotten to put these on. He's put it together. Um, obviously in a couple of k's it'll be all right but you keep driving as soon as you're turning you're loading it up it's just going to push the bearings you've got a whole space there there's nothing retaining the inside of the bearing and basically is uh, you're looking at about a 500 dollar stuff up because now we've got to uh, pull the bearings back off again um, and obviously the seal you can only install once um, so bearing seal and uh, the labor to remove them and uh, reinstall them again so about a $500 stuff up. So this is why you subscribe, turn the bell on, and hopefully this has saved somebody else from doing the same thing. Like I say, watch the videos, watch them all, watch them till the end. You're much better off subscribing, turning the bell on, getting yourself educated as it happens, as the videos come out, than going to look for the information when you go, oh, it's time to do injectors. Now I'm gonna look at the videos. You can do that, but if you've already watched a lot of videos and you're already all over it, it's gonna be helpful. Creates a lot of work if you've got to go and look at it later. Anyway, that's it, guys. Like I say, bell on. Catch you on the next one. Hope you liked it. Hope it saves you a mistake. And if you know someone with a Hilux and they're ever going to replace the front wheel bearings, at least send them this video. If not, you could even send them more. You could go into the uh, playlists. We've got a front hub bearing playlist there. Check out all the information in there and send them the link to those videos. Now, we're going to get this done. We're going to get these all pulled apart and butter bing back together with new ones. Take two. Anyway, there we are. It's all sorted out. New bearings again. Uh, butter bing, right? When these go on, they should just spin like that as well, right? So just gently tap them on. They're a little bit tight as they go on, but once they're on, they just spin like that. Don't worry about that. That gets clamped between the CV, the drive shaft, and uh, obviously the nut on the other side on the outside. 235 newton meters. Subscribe, turn the bell on. Butter bing, another problem solved, and hopefully many more avoided. Thanks for watching. See ya.